Hello developers, in this video tutorial I am going to teach you how to make an Omegle chatbot using JavaScript. As we can see that I have already published an article about this topic on my blog codingdictionary.com. I have also given this article link on the video description. Ok, let's move on to the tutorial. Before that let me explain what is Omegle. Actually Omegle is a website which is used to uh, talk to the strangers based on your uh, interests. That's it. You don't need to register on the website, just you have to uh, click the start chatting text or video button, then uh, chatting will be started automatically to the strangers. So you can meet your new friends. Okay, let me uh, teach you how to may set up or how to make an Omegle chatbot script. Actually it is possible via the JavaScript. For that you need to open the Omegle website first. Okay, then you have to uh, click uh, text or video. Now I am going to click the text. Then you need to accept the conditions then click confirm and continue. Click the stop. As uh, so you can see that this is the window where we can uh, send message to the strangers so we can talk. Just open this window. After that you need to copy and paste this javascript code to the developer console. Open the omegle uh, website then uh, press F12. Otherwise you can you right click anywhere then click inspect. So the console will be open and click uh, console here. Then clear the console using this uh, clear console option. You can use the shortcut control plus L2. Clear that. Then you need to paste the JavaScript code. When you hit enter, as you can see that when you hit enter, it will automatically uh, start the chatting and it will automatically send the message, hello I am Ranjit from India. It will uh, happen based on the interval, I set the interval to uh, 4000 milliseconds, okay. Then it will automatically disconnect the chat, then again it will start the chat. With the help of this, you can promote your websites, you can promote anything whatever you want, uh, that's it. Now let me explain uh, how the code is working. Let me stop this first. I just reloaded the window, then I click the text button, then I accept the agreement, okay, click stop. When you right click on the button and click the inspect, in the elements tab you can find the class for the button, uh, for, uh, for new button the class is disconnect btn, okay. Uh, let me open the visual studio code or notepad first. Uh, now I am going to use the notepad which will be very good. Okay. Actually in JavaScript using the query selector as you can see that using the query selector you can uh, get the class right you can get the element. Now I am going to create a new function. Function. You can use any name whatever you want for example uh, I am I'm going to use just Execu execute omegle the function and the opening and closing brackets okay now i'm going to create a new variable let button equal to so we need to use the query selector for that you need to use document dot query selector this is the method available in javascript then you need to uh, define the class. The class is disconnect button as, as, it, as I have already showed that disconnect button btn okay. So just wait a second. Okay just uh, define the class here disconnect button single quotation closing bracket. After that we need to send the message, for that we need to uh, get the class, right click the text area then click inspect. You can see that the text area class is chat message disabled, just you need to uh, copy the chat message class only, double click here so you can copy the class, I copied the class, okay. Now I am going to create a new uh, variable again, message box equal to we are using the same uh, query selector method so I copied the query selector 
then I'm going to replace the class here. Instead of disconnect button, I'm going to use chat message. Chat message, okay, that's it. Then we need to uh, get the class for the send button too. You can see that there is a send button. So just right click, then click inspect. So the class is send btn, okay. So we need to create the new variable again. Let send button equal to, you are, we are using the query selector for this too. Replace the chat message with send btn, okay. That's it. So we declare the variables and we get the elements using the query selector. After that, first what we need to do, first we need to click the new button, right? So we, when you click the new button, then only the chat will be started. So we need to click the new button. For the new new button, the class is disconnect button. We declared the disconnect button to the btn variable, right? So in JavaScript, there is a function called click. There is a method. So we need to use that button click so it will automatically click that button after that what we need to do we need to send the message right for that we need to use the text area text area chat message so we declare the chat message to the variable message box so now i'm going to uh, append the html for that i'm going to use the variable name message box dot inner html this is the method which is used to append the text in HTML. So I'm going to use hello. I am Ranjit from India. Okay. That's it. Finally, we need to send the message for that. We need to use the send button. So right click here. The class is send button. We defined the class here, send button for the variable send button, right? So we need to click the send button. So send button dot click. Okay. So the message will be sent automatically. Finally, uh, in JavaScript, we need to uh, use the interval. Otherwise, it will send. Uh, it will do the task immediately. So we have to wait for some seconds. Then we have to send the new message to the new stranger. Otherwise, Omegle will block you because Omegle has the good anti-spam system. So if you if you cheat the system, then it will be automatically block you or IP address. For that, you need to send the message in some delay. In JavaScript, you can use the set interval method. So I'm going to use set interval opening closing. We need to call the function execute omegle. Then we need to uh, define the delay in the second parameter. The first parameter is the function and the second parameter is the delay. So uh, I set the delay 4000 milliseconds and the first parameter we have to call is execute omegle. Okay. So it will call the function after 4000 milliseconds, right? As you can see that that's it. Now I'm going to copy and paste the code to inspect uh, element. When I click the inspect in the console, we have to uh, paste this code. Just clear the console, then paste the code and hit enter. When you wait for 4000 milliseconds, it will automatically uh, run the bot. As you can see that it is uh, send the message. Hello, I am Ranjit from India. It is again started the chat box. The stranger is chatting. Then it is typed, hello, I am Ranjit from India. Then it send the met, met, uh, message. Uh, it is showing one error. Uh, cannot read properties of null click. I think um, there is an error. Let me check what is it, what it is. Stranger has disconnected. Uh, let me check it first. So I'm just reloading the window to check whether the bot is working fine or not. 
फॉर एग्जाम्पल लेट मी टेक्स्ट हेलो मैं नहीं टेंटर इट विल शो द मैसेज व्हाट वी हैव सेंड सो द एंटर बटन इज नॉट वर्किंग प्रॉपरली सेंड बटन इट इज द बटन सेंड बी टी एन ओके सेंड बी टी एन डॉट क्लिक आई थिंक I used the wrong uh, variable here. Instead of yeah here, I uh, enter the class in uh, capital letter. Send capital B. That is not capital B. It is small b, right? Here you can see that in the website I turned correctly. In the notepad I turned it in caps capital letter. So that is why it is not send the message. Let me stop the window. Let me open the console. clear the console and paste the code now i am using the small uh, letter when i hit enter as you can see that there is no error please wait it will run stranger hello i am ranjit from india as you can see that it is uh, sending the message automatically that's it guys i hope uh, this video tutorial helps you to make an omegle bot and uh, helps you to set up an omegle bot using the java script with the help of this video tutorial you can uh, promote your website or your pro you can promote your product to the strangers all uh, around the world that's it if you want to receive more videos about omegle then don't forget to subscribe this channel if you like this video then don't forget to share this video to your friends